babes. In this video, I'm going to be doing a much needed that girl lifestyle glow up, incorporating healthy habits into my day to day life, self care, nurturing my body with some fruit and stuff. I also really want to do some things for my physical appearance. So that's where we're going to be actually starting off with right now. I have a nail appointment. They're a little crusty. I haven't gotten them done in over a month. I just can't handle this. I also have a hair appointment later. Just hoping that I can jump back into a productive lifestyle and a productive routine. Let's get started. I wanted to show you guys the really cute cases that I got from Caseify. Starting off with this Aura Inspired phone case. All of the prints and designs that Caseify have are chef's kiss. Caseify has endless print options where you can choose from a selection of curated prints or you can personalize a case with your favorite font and layout for a truly custom case. They're also drop test approved by 6.6 .6 feet. The next case I got is this really cute ultra impact case. Instead of having a 6.6 .6 feet drop, it's a 9.8 feet drop which is crazy i love all the little characters on it i think it's so freaking adorable i also got this clear phone case that has my name written in the bottom i also got it with the border it's really cute peach color the last case i got is this neon sign case that says gen z for jesus and it literally like isn't that so fun i don't know i just love that the lighting change all of the new impact and ultra impact cases are made from 65% recycled and plant-based materials. I've always wanted to do a drop test, so we're actually going to do that right now. Get excited, kids! This is my phone right now with the Caseify case. You guys can tell she is perfectly fine. I am 5'1", so I'm literally just going to be doing this to hopefully add a foot. One, two, three. And as you guys can tell, she is fandy dandy. Be sure to check out casetofi.com slash Adriana Noriega for 15% off of your Casetofi order. Thank you again, Casetofi, for sponsoring today's video. Let's get back into it. This is my hair. She ended up doing a blowout. I've never done one before. I kind of want to treat myself. She also gave me some face framers, a little bit of curtain bank action, and also added some curls with a curling wand. And then these are my nails, pink French tips with little gems on them. I wanted to go on a hot girl walk, but it is a little bit too hot for that. So I'm going to be waiting until the sun finishes setting so that my sweat isn't super apparent. So I figured I might as well put a 30 minute timer on and just clean up my room. The purpose of this video is to kind of just like positive habits. You know what I mean? So we're going to go ahead and clean up. Also, look at my cute necklace. I got it from Every Jewels recently and I am hashtag obsessed. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a timer.
besties. I kind of just want to try to live with that girl lifestyle. I really wanted to focus on incorporating healthy habits into my day to day life. I have not been waking up any earlier than like 11 o'clock for the past two weeks. So I really just wanted to challenge myself to wake up a little bit earlier than usual. If I was trying to wake up at 5 a.m. It didn't work. So here we are. I want to go to the gym first thing this morning. I feel like I have a little no energy. The moment that I start moving my body, I'm going to feel more better because, you know, oxygen and like blood flow and everything. Because I'm literally just going to leave my phone here because I know for a freaking fact that if I take it with me to the bathroom, I'm going to see on my phone for like at least 10, 15 minutes. It is so unnecessary. So we're not going to do that. I'm going to make my bed first because if I come back to my room with an unmade bed, I'm probably going to want to crawl back into it. So let's go ahead and make the bed and then go brush your teeth and stop. Where's my really coma? Yo, she's probably scared. She's like, oh, I've seen a very dark world. <laughs> Going to the gym, I wanted to take an immunity shot. I haven't done one of these in a while. Herbal supplements essentially just help boost your immune system, boosting your energy, your positivity, and your overall health. I'm gonna go ahead and take this like a champ. The last time I did one of these shots and I filmed it, I was like not about it. Okay, I'm gonna try to down it, but if I can't, whatever. <laughs> It honestly wasn't that bad. Like I genuinely expected it to just be like overpowered with whatever this crap was. But it was actually kind of really good. I genuinely really like this. I might go back to Target and get more of these. That was actually kind of bomb. Let's go to the gym. I'm so nervous. I definitely feel like a boost of energy. I think I've been up for around like 50-ish minutes now. So if you're trying to wake up earlier in the morning, maybe wake up like 10, 20 more minutes earlier than normally and literally stand. Even if you're just laid in bed, at least you're like awake and your body is just gonna kind of work itself and like i don't know if that makes sense <laughs> i'm gonna put a quick spritz of the glossier perfume on I'm trying to impress some guys some body filters i'm just joking let's go get them cakes baby anyways let's go <laughs> y'all i'm so happy important i always feel so good about myself after applying all of my skincare necessities this is the niacinamide by the ordinary this caffeine eye cream by the inky list for my moisturizer i'm going to be using this one by verse and i'm also going to be going in with this sunscreen by hero i know i know i always use sun bum but i wanted to try something new i also have these two products that i try to use on a daily basis this is a rose quartz jade roller that I use to kind of be puff and then I also like using this gua sha for sculpting and draining my lymphatic nodes. Also guys recently I got these little hair rolly thingies. I don't even know if these are gonna work. I'm gonna try to do something with my hair with these. Do the little bouncy vibes. We're gonna try. <laughs> I think I'm gonna change the ankle. That's chill. actually made myself a little list. I tried drawing a little fruit, trying it to practice self-discipline, baby. I also have this really cute little bag that says, have a great day. I think it accentuates the that girl vibe because it's tote bag, you know, that girls have tote bags. So yeah, let's go get some groceries. Also, the little things I put in my hair did nothing. Let's go. Nine, four, zero.
This is the Sedona bowl and it has strawberry, cucumber, no, <laughs> cucumber, strawberry, kiwi, blueberries, and I added bananas. I'm so excited. It literally looks so freaking stinking yummy. Look at it. Let me take a picture of it because that girl's take pictures. Oh, mom, be careful. Okay. The camera. Starting off this haul, I got my mom some flowers because her birthday is coming up and I just thought they were so pretty. They remind me of my mom. We're gonna be cutting them up and putting them in a vase right now. Some baby spinach, dozen cage-free eggs, three yellow bananas, a pineapple, cream cheese, some strawberries and raspberries, spinach, tortellini, a mango, two limons, some yogurt. Look how cute the packaging is, adorbs. A salad kit, some coconut and almond creamer, and last but not least, some Trader Joe's dark chocolate peanut butter cups. Forgot to mention, I also got strawberry mochi from Trader Joe's as well. These are literally my favorite. This is what $40 buys you at Trader Joe's. What the heck? The frick, bro? I barely touched that. That was not... done a face mask in so long i want to say it's been maybe a month this is the origins original skin retexturizing mask with rose clay i got this face mask at sephora like a year ago and i still haven't used it all up okay i'm gonna go ahead and leave this on my face for i want to say 10-ish minutes and while i have this you know chilling on my face i'm gonna do a journal prompt from pinterest i always get asked what i do when it comes to journaling and usually i use my five minute journal or my do it for yourself motivational journal i literally just go on pinterest and look up journal prompts and i literally just choose whichever one i want or how i feel and what i think would be beneficial for me to do i think i'm gonna do this journal prompt for self-love what is my favorite thing about myself what part of my life do i love right now what moment in my life is the most happiest memory what is your favorite part of your body and why how can i practice self-care today who am i most grateful to have in my life what are five things that make me smile and i think this is just a great way to practice positivity and gratitude i always talk about gratitude especially when i'm doing like my five minute journal for me it really does come down to realizing the stuff that you do have and just being grateful for the life that god has given you and doing whatever you can do to better your life and better yourself i'm gonna put timer i kind of look cute not gonna lie some reading before bed this is actually one of the habits that i've been keeping up with which is surprising because i tend to go on like i'm very proud of myself but i'm gonna be reading ugly love by colleen hoover it's been taking me a while to get through this book because i was a little bit intimidated by it not gonna lie it was a little spicy spice more than i was expecting but i'm gonna be reading this i also wanted to eat a little mochi that i got from trader joe's i already ate one but i genuinely like love these mochi so much i definitely think that treating yourself every now and then or honestly treat yourself every day queen treating yourself is just such a crucial part to self-care it really does the job so take this as a sign right now buy that five dollar coffee babe you deserve it i'm also going to be listening to this reading playlist on spotify I'm trying to romanticize the concept of me reading oh that book is so intense 
and I ended up reading the five chapters, which probably wasn't wise. Bro, I cannot put it down, but it's actually like 1 a.m. right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to sleep. I'm gonna be putting an alarm to wake up around like 9 o'clock tomorrow. As much as I would love to wake up at like 7 a.m. tomorrow, I just don't think it's wise to not get like a solid 7, 8 hours of sleep. I also put a glass of water so that first thing tomorrow I can just chug my water. I definitely do think that being that girl is essentially just becoming the best version of yourself. I think the best version of myself is truly just whenever I am practicing healthy habits and taking care of myself emotionally, physically, and mentally. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I definitely would encourage you to practice these healthy habits and incorporate them in your own life. I love you guys so, so much. I hope to see you guys in the next one. God bless and goodbye.